I just accidentally came to I thought it's just a nearby district. Usually I'm just walking here, but there are another street where actually I am now. And you know what? It's something unreal. Like you are in, not in South Korea, not in Seoul. Here is a today's market with flowers and vegetables. Here are so many cool cafes and local shops. Ah, so now we are waiting the line to Stasi shop. This is Korean brand. Uh, actually, I don't know anything about this brand because our friend, Chinese friend actually, that you saw in my previous videos, he wanted to visit this shop, so we came here, but they say that we should wait three and a half hours to get inside the shop. Can you imagine? Like it's Saturday in Seoul. It's usually you need to wait in line. Basically, here is super European vibe. So nice cafes and coffee shops, shops, local brands. Wow, I should definitely come back here, no, but not on Saturday. Just look at this cafe. Oh my God, so... No. China, buy. Uh, Chin Chinese, need. 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 Because it's so rare find in Seoul, like ordinary uh, Italian pizza, and here we see that it's a real oven. So I told my Chinese friend that this pizza is really good. It looks like real Italian one, and he said that he doesn't like this one. Anchoya? I don't know. <laughs> now we are explaining specialty food. Which food? Musin. Chocolate. Chocolate? Yeah. One more nice cafe, Rome's Cone. Oh my god. And don't say this, it's not like in Europe. Okay, guys, I just can't stop recording these cafes. So, if you're watching this video and think that these cafes uh, are like ordinary ones, typical, I should say, when you live in Asia, you totally forget how is like European or normal cafe look. Here in this culture, all cafes are totally different one and they're trying to make them like aesthetical, especially coffee shops, but still it's totally another style. And this street reminds me like France or Italy. <sighs> Maybe I'm just missing Europe. <laughs> I've been here like in Korea for seven months and I already get used to totally another architecture and cafes. So this kind of cafes which look like a European one. For me they are super cute and beautiful. <laughs> That's what's happening with you if you're ah, living in Asia. Guys, I want to show you what I'm wearing today. Today I have H&M top, H&M linen jacket, Zara pants and Astro shoes with a silver Zara back. I'll show you. I want to share with you several trends from South Korea. So guess the favorite color of Koreans. It's black one. However, it becomes trending color like two, three years ago. And now, especially on winter, if you go outside, you see black clothes everywhere. Next, Koreans are fond of cargo pants and layering. So if you want to look like more Asian with Asian style, wear more layers. 
next are tweed jackets yeah i know that this fashion trend over the world but still they started to wear these fashion trends much more earlier than other parts of the world number four is caps and masks yeah like typical situation when korean girl is wearing mask face mask and cap so you can see only her eyes and not in all cases <laughs> But I think they are a bit overpriced and they didn't allow me to record anything. Yeah, but it's basically it's understandable because it's central market Gersugil where all the tourists and local locals are coming. That's why it's, the prices are quite higher. My influencer has already this back. Wine and collection. Oh, this one. I just got inside the arcade. It's also in Gersegio. And here it's the cafe. What do you think, guys, about this color? Because I'm not sure about it. Have this similar one quick break on my channel. 